How does the BESA test different from other tests? Well, there's a couple of things. The biggest thing is that we figured out a way of combining Spanish and English scores. So on semantics, for example, we allow conceptual scoring, um, which a couple of tests are starting to do. Um, the other thing that we did is we have a composite score that incorporates the stronger or the best um, semantic score with the best morphosyntax score. And together that composite might incorporate, say, um, English semantics and Spanish morphosyntax. Because sometimes kids are in the process of learning English as a second language. They get to the point where they know more vocabulary in English than they do in Spanish but they still are better in um, grammar in Spanish. And so we needed to come up with a way of combining those two. And so that's something that we did that it's re that's really unique to us.